What is up everybody? Matt with Mikey Designs here. We're doing a pretty unique project in which we're combining screen printing, heat press foil, embroidery, and we're doing a neck tag as well. Stick around, we'll show you what we got going on. Welcome back everybody. So I'm running off the last of these t-shirts. It's a six color spot process front that we're doing. There's embroidery on the back along with some heat press HTV vinyl foil. And then we're doing another screen print on the back along with neck tags. Let me show you guys what we got going on here. Got the last shirt on the press. I'll walk you around and show you the six color print. I have to apologize in advance. We are working pretty late tonight. Trying to get this accomplished. Here's our last couple of shirts. Here is what the print looks like. Can't necessarily say I'm the biggest fan of this print, but I think it's coming out pretty awesome. I'll see if I can't get a shot in some, some better lighting. Looks pretty cool. Now I'm going to take you guys around the press and show you each one of these colors printing. Alright, so here we go. We got our white base going down doing a print print on the white base and then it will flash with the good old flashback next up we have our red going down now we have our yellow going down on top of that red this is kind of essentially doing those flesh tones and then the yellow in the eyeball. And then we have a purple going down for the hair and some of the flesh tones as well. Then we have our gray going down as well. And then we also have our highlight white. This is how we're creating those flesh tones. There's quite a bit of grays in here. Obviously we got the red and then some of the purple in the hair. Here we are. Here's the print again. You can see some of the half tones going on in here. You can see some of the highlight white going on in here. The eye is made up of a gray. You got some yellow, some purple, some purple going on in the hair. Obviously, red. We have a little bit of yellow for the flesh tones that are kind of the highlights of the face. Pretty creepy, but I'm happy with the way this print's coming out. Here is the back of the shirt. It is embroidered, as you guys can see. What we have to do is heat press some reflective HTV right there. Then we're going to screen print just below this. There's a couple phrases and then the year right below it. And last but not least, we'll do some tags on them as well. It's a lot of work, but I'm sure it will turn out pretty cool, all things considered. I'm gonna turn this fan back on. This fan's amazing. Woo, so humid. All right, so it is another day. I have the back print all set up on press, running off the last couple of shirts, aside from what's on the press itself. Let me show you what the design looks like. So here is the back of the design. Again, you can see the embroidery, and then we got our three color screen print. And let me show you how we have this going. We got our white base going down with a print flash print. Our flash is coming out. And it's going to print again. And then a flash. And over here we have our green and our turquoise doing these two wet on wet so I'm gonna finish the rest of these shirts off and then we're going to heat press the little reflective lens on there with some HTV and then we're going to do neck tags let's get to it time to heat press the reflective HTV into the embroidered glasses here. So here is my HTV. Actually, before I do that, let me press it for 
three seconds just to make sure all the moisture is gone. Now I'm going to place my HTV vinyl right in the center of these glasses here. This part is really tricky. I'm having to heat press it twice. Line this up so we're going to give it a firm press for about 10 seconds. Now I'm going to pull back my little carrying sheet here. I'm going to press it for about 15 seconds and that's just to make sure that the adhesive really digs into the shirt and the embroidery around it. That way it doesn't come up. Okay, there we are. You can actually see the texture of the t-shirt so I know it's in there pretty well. We're gonna let it cool down a little bit and I'll give you guys a close-up. So here we are. The HTV is all nice and pressed into the shirt. It looked pretty awesome. Last but not least, let's go ahead and do these neck tags. There is a little bit of an issue that I'm running into, so I'm gonna have to make those neck tags a little smaller. What I'm dealing with essentially is making sure that neck tag is above the backing of the embroidery and not going to hit the, the seam up here. It's gonna be pretty tough, but we're up to the challenge. Now on to the neck tags. So I did have to size this down. Got my piece of tape here. Kind of help me as a guide, make sure I get it in the correct place. Just gonna give it a light flood. A little hit. Bam! And we're good to go. And there you go. Here is the finished product. We have our embroidery with our heat press foil, screen print on the back, and then we have our neck tag label here as well then we have a six color spot process print on the front i think they came out pretty cool for you know for what it is <laughs> so this is a really cool way to combine different decorating methods onto a t-shirt essentially it's a great way to upsell with your client better quality t-shirt bella canvas t-shirts we have the embroidery the heat press vinyl that is foil we have the six color spot process print on the front, print on the back as well. We get to charge a good amount for it and they get to charge a premium for the shirt because of all these decorating methods on it. And it makes it more interesting. Thanks for tuning in. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe so that way you don't miss out on any future videos. Until next time guys, we'll see you later.